The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. Andrew Rogers here on the Eagles Sports Network with head coach Simon Duffy after his team ties with Nova Southeastern on this Saturday evening. Coach, go down early, get the, give up the one goal, but you get the equalizer from Alicia uh, there in the 73rd minute, I believe. So uh, what did you see from the team in the second half that set up that corner kick and that opportunity to, to end up tying this and drawing? You know, we, we talk about, again, the second half, and, and we just said it to the girls there, listen, we, we are a good team, but we could be so much more effective if we have that intensity in both halves. So, um, unfortunate to go down, but again, it's just we got pulled out of position a bit, and Nova are such a good team. They move it so quickly, so efficiently, um, and it was a really good goal. So, to come back in the second half, up the intensity a bit, um, keep the sharpness and passing, because out of possession was difficult for us today, dealing with the 3-5-2 or 3-4-3 that they went into, mm -hmm. and they just played in between the lines and have such intelligent smart players but I thought we were up for the task happy we got one back and I, I thought we were going to get one another one over the line but coming away from that 1-1 one, one, I'm not disappointed but it's it's night and day difference between that draw and the one we had at Ohio Dominican we came away from that thinking that was a complete loss you know so coming away from that going you know that's just two two teams two very good teams just duking it out that's what that was so I think it was probably might be an, an even result or a fair result in the end. All six goals this season have been scored in the second half. So, and you mentioned the intensity. Is there something else that you see that's different? I mean, Addy had an opportunity yeah. there at the penalty kick yeah. early on yeah. uh, that definitely could have gone your way. But what have you seen that's been different besides that intensity? How can you enforce that same effort, same offensive attack in first halves? I don't know. Uh, let me know if you do, if you figure it out. No, it's, I don't, again, you asked me before about the hardest thing is putting the ball in the back of the net. Yep. We, we scored that penno after five minutes. The tempo, the, the, you know, the whole shape of the game changes, but that's football. It doesn't, it, just, yeah, it doesn't go that way all the time. So I don't know, it's something we maybe just look at now. We obviously switch our focus to conference. Um, we've got Anderson away on Saturday, so um, let the girls rest, recover. We get back in on Monday, we look at the video. Um, we'll, have, we'll push them good on Monday and then from Tuesday on we'll focus on Anderson but one of the things Andrew we're going to address is hey can we can we match our second half performances in the last two games Nova and young Harris our second half performances I thought were excellent and worthy of winning a game can we do that for 90 because I, I think if we do Andrew there's not going to be many teams that can that can hang with us, you know. We always talk about the offense, but the defense yeah. has kept you guys in these games. They give up the early goal, yeah. uh, but they respond for the next yeah. 60 minutes or so to keep you in it and then allow you to tie it. So what have you seen from that back line? Yenta, Alicia, what have they done? MJ, what have they all done to not only keep those, put clean sheets together? How important has that been to help the offense kind of stay with it when it may not be there all the time? Massive. And, and another thing for us today was to try and keep a clean sheet. Obviously, we didn't, but the... The response after giving up the goal was was excellent because it, it's, it's funny how the tables turn. We get a penalty, you think, all right, we're going to go up 1-0. It doesn't happen, and then we concede a goal. It's so it's so difficult. So to be able to keep that focus and stay locked in for the rest of the game is excellent. And th the whole back four, um, you know, obviously we've added Abby Zander there this year, and she, I think she she's honestly been one of the most consistent players we've had. But mm -hmm. whether it's Noel either coming in or AC coming in or Elena, um, or MJ, they've just done a, a really quality job back there and I, we can't forget Laura behind them. I thought she was really good today, very calm, under pressure and did a really good job. Kicking was good, decision making was good as well. Best of luck as conference play gets going. He's Simon Duffy, I'm Andrew Rogers for the Eagle Sports Network.